Hi guys, it's Nana and Raven from Nana's Nursery and Reborns. What are we going to do today, Raven? We're going to change the, the babies. Who are the babies? Uh, Gavin and Bella. Gavin and Bella. Okay, um, what are we going to change them into? Pastel outfits. For what? For Theme Thursday. Theme Thursday. Okay, before we get started, Miss Raven wanted to do something. Um, what did you want to do first? I wanted to open up a package. Okay, well go ahead and open up a package. Ooh, what is it? I spotted this card. Okay, this card. There's a clear. And on the back it says thank you. It says Twinkle Tots Vintage. Vintage clothing for children. And Nana got it on um, an Etsy shop. And on the back it says thank you. Oh yes, it says thank you. I think this is for Gavin. Yep, it's for Gavin. Uh, so, so describe it for us. So it has. What is it? A, so it's like a little sleeper, and it has on it. It says, "I love Daddy." I can read. I can kind of read cursive. Um, and then it says, "I love Daddy" on the shoulders, and it has a few. Hearts and there's like a red, like train. Right. It is a white sleeper, <clears throat> and then the collar and the sleeves are a pattern. Um, the blue part of the pattern. It says, "I love Daddy Heart." I love Daddy Heart. And then it's striped, and then it has little choo-choo trains, and the choo-choo trains are all in red. <laughs> so there's that one. There's a hat that came with it. There is a hat that came with it. It it's, it's the same pattern as the sleeves and the collar where it says I love daddy in blue and then the little red train striped and it's a little, it's like a little boy's bonnet with a with a tie. Okay, that's the going out switch is the last thing. So Oh it has like two little like people I think. What are they? They're toy soldiers. Oh, they're toy soldiers, and it has this like plaidish like lighter blue print. and darker blue. Yeah, and it also has like these blue, these like light blue. It's kind of a medium blue. Yeah, like medium blue and like uh shoulder sleeves. Sleeves, and then it has. Buttons right here. Around the white. waistband. And then the collar is white. It is white. It almost, it's like a onesie, and it almost looked like it's, uh, oh, it's got a little elastic uh, feature in the back. Um, but it's almost like, um, like overalls all built into a onesie. So it's super cute. But that's kind of what Nana wants to do with Gavin, is uh, he's going to be kind of a vintage baby. So, so, are you ready to change Miss Bella? Yeah. Okay. Let Nana move the camera a little bit. And I've got this squeaky tripod again. <coughs> Nana's still having problems with all of her cameras and all of her electronics and her internet. And I've been going nuts. But we're going to keep trying and we're going to try different cameras and uh, we'll get it done so we can keep up with all the fun stuff we have in store. So you can go ahead. Bella looks a little tired. <laughs> Here's Sally. Okay, well let's get her changed. Okay. <clears throat> you have to stay on the side. Okay. 
Bella's wearing her little slipper boots that are the light brown cheetah with a little fur cuff. And those came with her. Nana got those for her. Yeah, you did show the bows on them. Oh, I'm sorry. They do. They have pink little bows on them. And there's these white, these plain white socks. Yeah, plain white socks. And Bella is wearing um, a little outfit. It is all pastel pink. And then it's got little kitty cat heads, little hard balloons. Owls, um, and it says Bobby. You're right, and it has high, and it says little purple bows. They're just tiny little prints all over it everywhere. Oops, I'm sorry, guys. So, oh, and it also has oh, wait, little, little crowns. It says high, cute, little bunny rabbits. There's rainbows, and there's a unicorn. Um, it's actually a little shooting star with rainbows kind of behind it, but it's just a little print. No. And she also has the onesie that actually matches it. It's long sleeve and has a little ruffle detail on the top of the shoulder. Yeah, I love Bella. She was the first rainbow that we had. Yep, yeah, she is. But it's weird because Gavin is her uncle and he's a newborn. Oh. Okay, I gotcha. He's my uncle. Bella's uncle. And my. That would be Bella's great uncle. That would get confusing, wouldn't it? <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Gentle with her. You're so hard on her poor little head. <clears throat> oh, you're gonna kiss her head now. I got it. Okay, now she's gonna put on. Um, this? A yellow onesie. It's got, looks like a ball jar that is all colored pink, has a yellow flower with a silver glitter detail. And then and coming out of the jar is silver flowers with little blue petals. And then it's got a silver bow. Underneath the jar, it says so cute and light blue. And then the sleeves have like an angel wing sleeve that are sheer and it has pink, yellow, and blue stripes. Baby blue. And yes. Mm -hmm. It has a pastel baby blue. And the whole onesie is pastel yellow. Which is why I picked it out. Because it's like a pastel color. Can you scoot around just a little bit, sweet? Right there, perfect. Thank you. That's good. While she's doing that, I'm also going to show you something that Raven found in her room while she's getting her pastel stuff ready. Um, Bella is using this little blanket today. It's a little baby doll patchwork quilt that Nana made for Raven when she was little bitty. It's got uh, different pastel quilt blocks. There's a uh, a fun spring green pattern with little butterflies, pink, blue, white butterflies. And then it has, um, gosh, I don't even know what that texture is. It's kind of like, I don't know, like a, mm, I know they used to make blankets out that all the time, but I, I honestly don't even know what that's called. But there's a, a pink fleece with white stars. Um, a white fleece with a dark pink check on it. Um, there's pink satin around the whole blanket. And I remember when I found this material, I just loved it. And I wanted to make a whole quilt for Raven, <clears throat> but it was very expensive. So I was like, I'll just make a baby doll blanket. So that's what I did. So that's what Miss Bella can cuddle, and that's going to be her lovey today. Like right. Okay, so now Bella is getting her little matching skirt on that goes with the little onesie set. It's got a sheer skirt with the pink, light pink, and a pastel light blue. Um, and it goes all the way around the skirt, and it's kind of, like I said, a sheer organza type of material. 
The waistband is a stretchy silver waistband. And now Miss Raven is going to put a fun little pink hair tie in. Now further up on the top. Yep, right there. That would be perfect. Grab a little bit more hair. So let me part it here. Hand her here for a minute. I'll help. <laughs> You like Bella having cute little ponytails? Yeah. Well, that's the fun part of having a baby that's got hair. She can have a little ponytail. Gav is not that fun, but he's really fun to play with because he still looks Can really I put the hair tie in? Yeah. Okay. But I'm going to put the bow in. Yes, you can put the bow in. Then I'll help with the hair tie, and you can help with the bow. I'm not very good at putting the hair tie in. Well, that's just going to take practice. You're, you're still just now learning how to do your own hair ties to put your hair up. So you're doing really good with that. I'm still seven. You just turned seven. Yeah. January. The 24th. Sorry guys. I'm trying to hurry. Okay, there's her cute little fun sprout. <clears throat> gorgeous. Those are actually some Easter bows that I found from Miss Raven at Walmart. Um, it's got several different layers. The one the one ribbon is white and has little Easter eggs with different colored chevrons. It's a uh, pink, green, and purple and yellow chevrons. And then it's tied up with um, and it's that cross grain or gauze grain ribbon. That's too close, sweetie. And uh, then it's got a, a sheer sparkly ribbon behind it and, the, and then behind that there is a peachy colored ribbon with tiny white polka dots, green ribbon with white polka dots, and yellow ribbon with white polka dots. So it matches her outfit just perfect. And she has a pink little passy. She does have a pink little passy. Okay, so Miss Bella's all done. You can cuddle her up with her little blankie over there. And then we're gonna get ready to do cute little Mr. Gavin. Well, she's kind of hiding behind. Oh, look at that. He's gonna up a little bit. Okay, Nana just bought this today. We have a local, um, uh, it's called a swap shop here. So it's on Facebook online. It's hiding his little face. Um, and I got it for $15. Oh, that a lot, but. Can you pull it off that side? Oh, there we go. There, now it's not hiding his cute little face. So, I just wanted to show you that. It's a nice neutral color, so it can be for the boys and the girls. So, that was kind of my find for the day. So, we've got the little boppy sitting here for him. So, we're going to move over. Raven, you want to get him out? Okay, so here's cute little Mr. Gavin. And Anna's gonna change him. Can you sit on the other side so you can help yeah. hand me stuff? Yeah. <coughs> okay, and then we're taking off the outfit we put on the other day with the blue teddy socks and the gray shoes and his little tan khaki sweater with the navy blue bears and then the stripes on it. He's got the light blue pastel onesie on. So we're gonna take that off. I'm gonna take off his little pants. Oh, better unsnap it, huh, buddy? I'm just throwing you all over the place, aren't I? Very, very good baby. Yes. We like to make sure. 
Oh, sorry guys. I'm turning the camera. Didn't mean to. There. Sorry, I'm trying to adjust it so I can see in the frame. There, that's better. <coughs> sorry. buddy and I have a correction I actually was finally able to contact his sculptor today um, and we talked we actually had a really nice chat um, it's Georgia Piggott and it's actually spelled J-O-R-J-A P-I-G-G-O-T she was his sculptor and uh, she confirmed that he is indeed the uh, Peyton sculpt. He did not come with the COA. He was her 15th sculpt ever. And this little fellow was made in 2009. So this is a little old guy. He's in excellent condition for his age. So we're gonna go ahead and change his diaper. Yeah, he's a newborn. He is a newborn, but he was he was born, he was reborn in 2009. What year were you born? 2011. He is two years older than you, Miss Raven. Isn't that crazy? I wish he was born in 2011. <laughs> then we would be born in the same year. Alright, can you hand me his white little onesie, please? Okay, we're just going to put a little white one on. Probably should have put it on him the other day, but I didn't. So, anyway, so I wanted to clear that up about him. But I did, I had a very wonderful conversation with her um, through Messenger. It was, it was nice. So, and I sent her pictures of him, and uh, I actually sent her a picture of my husband's baby picture and him side by side, and I said that is the reason why I picked him, because he is a, a photo baby for my husband. So, that was really exciting, and she thought that was just really cool. She really liked it. So. A lot of babies look like me. It's weird. <laughs> You're silly. Okay, I'm going to show you what we're going to put on him now. <coughs> now he has his white onesie on. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. I also ordered this off of, uh, no, I got this one on eBay. And it's a vintage <laughs> onesie. It has a white Peter Pan collar with a tiny little pastel blue white edging around the Peter Pan collar. It's got a tiny little blue and white uh, rocking horse applique right at the front. And uh, I don't even know what this material is, but it's a stretchy, maybe it says what it is. It says fiber content, polyester. That's what it says, it's polyester. Anyway. So, the reason why I want to do the vintage stuff is it's kind of um, like it's a look-alike or photo baby of my husband. And that's kind of why I decided I wanted to go with the vintage theme. But it's, it's a little bit longer than a onesie, so I guess it's more, than, more like a romper. But it's all a really pale blue. Um, almost like a pale aqua blue. Because it's not necessarily a baby blue. on over his head. I think we'll get it this way. And I got this one also a little bit bigger because you never know what sizes the clothing ran then. So, And I didn't want it real tight on him. I found that the newborn clothing was a little bit tighter on him than I liked. Hi cutie. Look at you. Mr. Handsome. Mr. Handsome. Mr. Handsome. 
I want to call him Mr. Cutie Pie. Mr. Cutie Pie. You're so silly of me. Okay. Alright, there he is in his little outfit. And see, it's a little bit longer, but um, like I said, Gavin has three quarter limbs, so I get it a little bit bigger so it covers up his cloth. So he looks very handsome in that. <coughs> oh, he's fussing. I better give him his binky back. We don't want him to be sad. Okay, there you go, buddy. Let's scoot you down so you can see. Right now, I'm putting on the really, really fuzzy soft sockies. And then I've got one, one last thing to show you. So in reality, for his age, his, his, this whole sculpture, the art, everything, the whole doll, he is in excellent, excellent condition. Okay, so since he's a little vintage baby, I found and purchased some little vintage shoes. And um, the shoestrings were pretty, pretty yucky, so I kind of went ahead and washed them. And these may be a little bit too big for him, so um, I may save them for another ball, but we'll see. Can I tie your shoes? No, let me do them because they're very fragile, sweetheart. Yeah, okay. they kind of look too big, too big on him, guys. So I may have to keep looking for some little vintage booties or something for his little feet because he definitely has newborn feet um, and these do not have a size on them I actually got them in their original box and there is no size there's no size in the box and there's no size on the shoes but looking at them I would I would guess they're probably a one because <laughs> they kind of look like clown shoes on this poor little fella can you see them oh let me scoot him let me scoot it back just a little bit. There, you can kind of see him. You can see him a little bit. So, I may keep have to look. But that's cute. Okay, he needs his lovey so he can cuddle. This is his lovey. Yep, there's a little lovey. His little lovey is a off-white teddy bear with a little sleep sack hat with blue and white tassels and a hat band and a solid blue hat. Um, he's holding, the teddy bear is holding a little blanket with a moon and the teddy bear's body is a pastel blue. His little feet and hands are pastel or <coughs> off-white. His nose is a pastel blue and the little bear is sleeping. And he also, he also sings. <laughs> Amen. We say that every night, don't we, Miss Raven? I always say my prayers before yes. I go to bed so I'm safe. Yes. I know the stars will keep you safe. Okay, guys, I think that's all, all we've got for today. I'm going to scoot Miss Bella over so we can see them together. Here, I got her. <clears throat> Let me zoom it out. Zoom it out. Oh, I have to adjust it. And here we go. I'm so backwards on this. Oh, my screen was flipped. Sorry, guys. Okay, so you want to get down there in between them? Well, that should be the end of our video. So, get down, sweetie. Bye, guys.